What's going on, Steelers fans? My name is Max Gretzel. I wanted to chat with all you guys here for a couple of minutes about what it's been like, not only so far this season in 2024, but also earlier on in the offseason as well for the Pittsburgh Steelers. And let's start with Justin Fields coming in and taking over for Russell Wilson, who we thought was going to be the starting quarterback until that calf issue got caught up here early on this year. And now Justin Fields so far here and the first five weeks of this season has produced at a pretty high level. He's got five passing touchdowns compared to only one interception. Hasn't been super efficient in the passing game, but at the same time, he's been efficient with his legs. We know that. He's done that throughout his whole career, especially in college and now into the NFL, 44 attempts. He's gotten over 100 rushing yards so far this season and three rushing touchdowns as well. So the last two losses after the 3-0 start have been by a field goal in each of those losses. So, so far, the defense has kept the Steelers in football games. We know T.J. Watt, who leads the way with four and a half sacks, will be there throughout the whole season as long as he stays healthy. And Micah Fitzpatrick, who has been a stud since college as well at Alabama, leads the team in tackles with 26. So the defense is, is the biggest story here. Mike Tomlin, who continues to be on the hot seat year after year with this Pittsburgh Steelers team, continues to win games. Not only that, have a winning record when the season ends and also make the playoffs as well almost every single year. So it feels weird saying that, but again, we go into a season with the Steelers where expectations were minimal for the most part, uh, depending on what side of the country you live on. But when you talk about Russell Wilson coming in off of a massive contract in Denver, expected to be the starting quarterback, and now Justin Fields has been inserted into the starting quarterback role, it remains to be seen when Russell Wilson is healthy, will he come in and be the starting quarterback? But at least in my opinion, the Steelers this year with the rushing attack and Najee Harris, their offensive line, that's always been pretty stout for the most part. I'd say moving forward here as the opponents hopefully get weaker when you take a look at the schedule, especially here in week six against the Raiders, a team that's struggling. No Devontae Adams, we know that. Um, it, uh, it's speculation about him being traded. It's been a crazy five weeks so far here. It's NFL season. But when you talk about moving forward here in 2024 and then into 2025 and beyond with this Steelers team, how long will Justin Fields be the starting quarterback? That remains to be seen. And the speculation about Russell Wilson and what he brings to the table, not only as a leader, uh, but what he still has left in the tank here at his age at the NFL level. So we'll see what happens this weekend against the Raiders. Appreciate you guys taking some time to tune in here. Again, my name is Max Gretzula. Stay tuned, everybody. It's going to be a fun rest of the year.